Hello, welcome to my newest video. This is an update to my UK BOSS timetable application, BOSS Times. Let's load it in. In one or two changes, which I'm going to show you now. I'll just display. First thing you notice up here is a new button called Refresh. What that does is refresh this window here with the stop table table that's already been selected. If I go to a different one, go for one where CJ Micro's close to them, and if I click on the icon bar button down here, you see it goes back to the original window, original stop. By clicking back down there and hitting the refresh button, it stays on this one here. So I do if you have it left there for a while and everything's out of date. Back to this one here. So I've used this one here where the uh, Wakefield show is. Another new thing is an option to save the table, the bus stop table, as a CSV file. Click on that and open it up. That's the stop details as a CSV file. As well as the other options which have been in previous versions. Also new, you click on the timetable button. There's two times in now, arrival time and departure time. Arrival time's got an A, departure time's got a D. Obviously where it terminates, it will have no departure time. That's what an A there. Also the window is slightly wider to accommodate more information. There is some of them, not all this information was getting through. One of the reasons for that is the change of the API it uses from, which stopped it all from working. We should know there were some changes in the same thing for them to work, but it's no different to what it was before, so there's no point in showing that. If you want to see that, look at one of the other videos. It can be downloaded from my software, links provided. Also, if you do find the uh, software useful, why not buy some more merch, link provided, or you'd like some money to me through my Ko-Fi pages, also links provided. Thank you, goodbye, and see you on the next video, whatever that's going to be about.